Hi there ladies, welcome back to my channel, it's Manisha here. So today I've got something really exciting to share with you. Um, I recently purchased a new um, steamer from AliExpress. Um, I will leave the direct link for the seller down below. So I've purchased this, it hasn't been sent to me for review, I'm not affiliated with it or anything like that, but I'm really um, pleased with how well it's worked. I've used it a couple of times now. Um, like some of you know, um, I am wearing you know gel manis and things like that so i've got a um, mani on at the moment um, and i'm going to show you how easy it is to take it off with the steaming method and um, because um i don't know about you guys but i just don't have time to soak them i get frustrated annoyed um you know and it just takes seems to take forever i just want to move on to the next design and things like that so you know like we've all got things to do family things work and whatnot so um you know, I just don't have the time to sit there steaming it off and I mean not steaming sorry soaking it off because it does actually take quite a while to do that so this is a new method that's come out and um, this is the box that it's come in and it's got nice and um, clear instructions on the outside on how to use it and um, there are different um, types of plugs that you can get and um, so you can get like a US one and um, you can get uh, EU one I think it is or UK or something like that and um, I got the um, Australian one because I live in New Zealand and Australia and New Zealand have the same power sockets and so I got that one so it ended up costing me a couple of dollars more but there are other ones out there by some reptile you know big big companies and they're charging pretty much double what than what I paid for this and so obviously AliExpress always free shipping well I always look for free shipping um, and I can't remember the exact price I will look it up um, and I'll pop it on the bottom of the screen so you know how much I paid for it but it's a really really simple system so it does it's this is the unit here itself I haven't even peeled the thing off on and off switch so on light goes on light goes off plug goes in there um, it's got some little rubber feet on the bottom when you take the lid off this is the thing that you put your um, fingers into so you can do all you know your hand at the same time to open it you know you just turn it and it clips off like that now these little rubbery things excuse the state of it because like I said I have been using it you do actually get um, spare ones of those in, in this set I don't know if all sets have them but my set came such a tidy kiwi tidy thing. Um, mine actually came with four extra things rubbery things so you know they obviously perish after a while so you've got extra ones and it came with an extra tray for the acetone which I'm just going to show you how that works so yeah you basically just turn that take it out put the new one in lock it back in place so it's kind of sandwiched in between the lid this is the little tray that you pop your acetone into and that must be the warming element there so that just sits in there now the they do say between five to ten mils of acetone and um, just goes into there and you turn it on and um, the red light comes on once the the S light which is I think is a green one off the top of my head once that one comes on you're good to go it takes literally like a minute or two minutes and then you can just pop your um, I just have this on here anyway so then you can just pop your fingers in there and you kind of curl them around I kind of curl them around like that you don't want them touching the bottom so just curl them around and um, yeah sit and wait so I, I tend to just set the timer on my phone um, and just set it for five minutes and then I just pull them out and have a look and if it looks like it's peeling you can take bits off I just switch it off at that stage and um, otherwise if it's really stubborn or you've had it on for quite a while like mine's probably about three days old now um, you can soak it for um, sorry I keep saying soak steam you can steam it for like 10 minutes so I'm actually gonna do the next part speed up um, I'm going to buff my nails, they tell you to lightly buff the obviously the surface of the nail um, to get rid of the, the top layer, the shiny layer, so that the steam can penetrate it. Now when you're using this, there's no not hardly any sound, you know, you can just hear like a steam sort of sound, um, and, and it doesn't get hot, like I don't know if, what it's like if you touch the bottom of the thing, because I haven't done that, but you know, I kind of just keep my fingers out of the way, but it doesn't get hot, it's just really weird how it works, it's like a water vapour or something. And you take it out and all your um, 
polish has just like gone curly and crackled. And then you just use your little, um, let's grab one off the bench, just use your little wood stick and then you just basically scrape it away. So I'm going to show you that bit next. So yeah, just stay tuned. Okay, so we've just got a few seconds to go there, and there we go, so that's done. Just turn that off, and I'm just going to pull them out. Oh, shush, I do stop this thing, done. Um, yeah, look at that. Okay, I'm just going to move my iPad away, because I don't really want anything water or anything on there. And I'll just show you, shuffle that out by a little bit, and... Oops, get in focus. You can see that is literally just falling off, just flaking off. I'm not forcing it or anything. It's actually just coming off really easily. There's no no pressure or anything like that at all. And this is a um, just a wooden stick. It's not like one of those metal scrapers or anything like that. So you can see how well it works. It's my nails have only been soaking in there for um, five minutes. Um, you know, if you've got a mani that's got more layers of gel or it's been there for a while or, you know, you've got um, things glued to it and whatever, you'd want to probably soak it for the full 10 minutes. Um, whereas I've just got some, you know, um, chameleon flaky powder on it and um, yeah, it's, it's just coming off really easily, which I just had some stamping on top, so yeah. I do normally do a better clean than this, it's just that I'm trying to show you how easy it actually is. Um, yeah, so definitely do recommend this product. I will, like I said before, link the, the direct link for the one, the, the um, person I bought it off off AliExpress. Um, the shipping was pretty quick as well, and I was quite impressed with that, so um, definitely give them five stars for that. I did forget to mention that it does come with a little um, manual and warranty card. It's not about the warranty card, I mean, I don't normally have a, a guarantee for very long for these sorts of things. Um, and for what, how much you pay for it, I don't know whether it's worth chasing anything up, but um, it seems to be working fine. They say that they guarantee it for three months, <laughs> so, you know... It's not really a long time. I usually like to have at least a year on something, but anyway, but there's really nice clear instructions on how to use it. So yeah, definitely give it two thumbs up. Um, I'm really impressed with it, and it's going to save heaps of time for me in the long run. And um, they do, you know how you normally when you're soaking with um with acetone, um you know you you nail your skin and stuff around your nails gets really dry. So you know usually you put like Vaseline or um you know, cuticle oil or something like that. You can still do that while you do it. Well, I've done it before. I, I've just forgot today because I was in a bit of a rush, but you can actually still do that and it will protect. But you can see that it hasn't really, um, they don't look the best now, but it hasn't actually overly dried it out or anything like that. If you do have stubborn bits left that aren't going to come off and you don't want to force it off, the idea is you just soak it for a little bit longer, give it another couple of minutes or go up to another five minutes and um, Bob's your uncle, it should all come off. So yeah. Check it out ladies, um, leave me any questions and comments that you have down below and um, apart from that thanks for stopping by and I hope you all have a great day and also if you haven't subscribed definitely subscribe to my channel, you don't want to miss out on all these um, great things I have to share with you, it's free to do so and I'm also on Instagram too so definitely follow me there as well and apart from that thanks ladies, bye.